All right, so I've had this flagpole on for all about two days, and I've had at least seven people stop and ask me uh, how I made it. And uh, this is one thing that yeah, does wrap around this little hole. I mean, it's just a little flagpole. All right, what we did is we got a door hinge. Uh, yep. Yeah, a door hinge and uh, cut it where it fit just inside this and uh, so this whole thing is three inches wide down here because it's a two inch this is a two inch receiver but it widens out here to three inches so we made this about two and a half uh, inches wide and made it where we had another uh, one of the little holes where we can stick something through uh, we made sure that one of those was cut off. And, um, all right, let me just kind of show you how this works. We grinded this down back behind there, welded the back plate on. This is a trailer hitch, or this is like a little D ring pin. And you would, and, uh, you know, one thing, first thought I had was if you need to roll, lower down the tailgate, you're not going to be able to. So we made, this it's a little quick release i'm gonna have to hold this up you just pull it out it's a little tight so pull it out just like that and now this is why we did a door hinge it literally just comes straight down and leans on top of this and if you don't have that there it still didn't hit the ground. You just gotta, for patriotism reasons, make sure this does not hit, hit the ground. Uh, <clears throat> so it's literally a door hinge. We welded here, up and around, and on the sides. We did weld down here and quickly realized that was a mistake because this, uh, actually closes down a little bit and hits so um that was kind of a problem a little bit but we just kind of worked it back and forth and got it where it goes good this is a uh you see this little hole here that's for drainage i would definitely put that in there um this is just a thick bar that we found uh it's a pretty thick bar um close to a fourth of an inch I'd say thick and um, we just found it lying around so we got it uh, we got it where it um, has a hole here and here and here and here and we have it just zip tied in there and we have um, of course this door hinge but this is actually grinded down in an angle so that way when this is sticking up, it sticks straight up or fairly close. We got, we're a little bit off, but when it sticks straight back, it sits very close to straight up. And when you're driving anyway, it's gonna be kind of bending down, so it doesn't matter. So <clears throat> what we did here is we took the little piece where it, um, where this, uh, this used to be part of the door hinge, basically. And the pin ran through that little hole right there that sticks off. And uh, so we got that there where we put that little pin through. And uh, welded it completely around it, all the way around, and then painted over. Uh, this is welded on to the door hinge and um, it's really, a, it was time consuming, but uh, honestly, just a couple of drills and a, uh, I think we had a grinder wheel just to grind off all the powder coating off of the hitch just to make it faster. And a uh, angle grinder was all we really used to do all this. So it's really not a hard process. It's just kind of, Get out there and do it and i like it because you can 
uh, still have your trailer hitch or in my case you can have your recovery hitch in there and uh, I did you probably see I've got some tape in there just so it doesn't so just so this hitch doesn't wiggle near as much it still wiggles some of course but um, I just got some black duct tape and folded it up you can't really see it so may take that out but it just kind of routed around one thing is if you have a backup camera yeah it's kind of useless now because you know the flags there so you see you may see one of the corners or something or if the winds kind of moving you may see a little bit but it's basically useless now <laughs> um so yeah that's how i made my flagpole and um be sure to leave a comment if you have any questions about it i usually answer it pretty quick i'm uh not really i don't think i'm hard to get in touch with and if you have any questions or if you did a uh, flagpole like this because of this video love to hear that um, and if you have anything that you think I should change with this be sure to just let me know thanks and uh, be sure to like and subscribe we also have these stickers for sale so uh, we're on the we had to get another batch of them because they sold out within a week so if you want some of these be sure to comment if you're in Arkansas and, uh, just let me know